वेलकम टू द न्यू सीरीज रिलेटेड टू मास्टर स्टडीज इन इंग्लिश इन ऑस्ट्रेलिया दिस इज़ द फर्स्ट वीडियो आई एम मेकिंग दिस वीडियो रिलेटेड टू द एडमिशन इन टू यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ साजबोर्ग यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ अप्लाइड साइंस साजबोर्ग इट्स अ जॉइंट एडवेंचर लाइक बोथ यूनिवर्सिटी यूनिवर्सिटीज ऑफ यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ साजबोर्ग एंड यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ अप्लाइड साइंस साजबोर्ग दे विल इशू अ डिग्री इन मास्टर्स इन इमेज प्रोसेसिंग दिस डिग्री इज टोटली इन इंग्लिश एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई वुड लाइक टू एक्सप्लेन यू वट आर द रिक्वायरमेंट्स टू अप्लाई एंड हाई यू कैन अप्लाई एंड वट आर द चांसिस टू क्रैक द इंटरव्यू एंड गेट अ पोजिशन इन दिस कोर्स सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टड first of all i would like to request all of you to subscribe my channel because this is a new video and uh, i would like to get a uh, comment from your side like in which field you want to apply in austria so i would like search the concern university and their uh, applying method uh, and their application method and i will create a video and post it in this channel uh, so let's start it first of all uh, i would like to discuss the basic requirements what is the basic requirement to apply for this university yeah? uh, so they didn't specified a field from which your bachelor should be yeah? this is a master level degree they definitely need a, your bachelor's degree and your transcript the subjects in your bachelor must be in the domain of computer science plus uh, mathematics plus image processing so the criteria is that you must have Uh, studied fundamentals of computer science uh, fundamentals of mathematics uh, and uh, basic engineering mathematics subjects in your bachelor and then you also have some courses related to image processing four year series uh, z transformation laplace series uh, and uh, these are the basic requirements uh, which Uh, give you uh, gives you the eligibility to apply for this uh, master level course yeah uh, so in conclusion you could have a bachelor in computer science that would eligible uh, that would give you eligibility to apply for this course you could have uh, bachelor in mechanical engineering bachelor in electrical engineering bachelor bachelor in uh, applied mathematics bachelor in uh, electronics bachelor's in image processing uh, or automation yeah these are the some domains which from which you could apply to this uh, degree yeah and the second thing is that uh, ielts or toefl uh, they have mentioned in their website like uh, you can submit ielts and toefl results um, with your application but it is not a necessary thing it is uh, uh, not a necessary they will uh, the process is that uh, you have to apply on their website i will i will mention the link of a uh, uh, online application in the comments you should like click that link and will your form and submit all your documents and uh, they will uh, check either you have studied enough computer science subjects and uh, mathematics and uh, image processing uh, subject yeah and then they will invite you for an uh, interview in this interview they will judge your english language skills they will check either you have enough language skills uh, or do you, uh, or you required a uh, Uh, I'll sort of fill exam. Yeah. Um. Normally, if you have finished your bachelor's in English uh, and you have English proficiency from your last university, uh, in that case, you are not required to submit any type of, uh, basically, uh, English proficiency exam results. Uh. The second thing which I would like to mention you is that when you are uploading your documents on the online portal. please be careful you have to write the end name at the end of each document for example uh, degree your lord dash last name i will also like mention the example in the description of the video uh, what documents you will upload is the second question uh, so you have to upload your bachelor's degree you have to upload your transcript and then you have to upload your actual uh, cv you have to write a motivation letter why you want to apply to this university why and how 
your last degree is connected with this degree and what is your future plan uh, in the domain of image processing and then uh, the next thing is like a letter from your university that uh, your studies were as in english english proficiency letter is this letter called uh, and then uh, you have to write uh, to upload also uh, equivalence or eligibility letter this letter you can uh, search in my channel uh, the basic requirements to apply for a master's degree in austria the video will explain uh, all the details are related to this letter yeah and these are the letters uh, the documents you have to apply uh, upload to the application and then if everything went according to the plan and they will invite you for an interview and in this interview they will judge your language skills they will uh, check your basic skills related to uh, computer science and mathematics and there will be very few questions related to image processing but yeah at the end of the interview they will uh, like after 14 days they will uh, send you an acceptance or a pre-acceptance letter and then they will ask you to submit a legalized uh, uh, degree or transcript and then they will offer you i hope that i explained this one and this is my first video to a specific subject i will try to make more videos please like and subscribe my channel so uh, in next days i will try to cover more subjects related to engineering and computer science and then we will come to uh, applied sciences uh, this is my plan and uh, yeah i will like to thank all of you for your time to watch this video and uh, hopefully we will meet in next video bye bye